Ah, <sighs> Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. Alright, so the series is about a multi-generational family and follows them through their bizarre adventures. There is currently 8 parts and 8 JoJo's in total, and 4 of the 8 parts are animated, with the 5th part still going on. All the parts are different and unique, so the show never gets boring. Well, except for the beginning of part 4. But how different, you may ask? Well, I don't know, you tell me. Part 1 is about vampire stone masks, magical sun power, speed wagon, and ultimate brotherly rivalry. Part 2 is about ancient pillar man sun power, stone mask, pulling an atomic gun and shooting up a store even though there are people in it, German speed wagon again, and cops beating up little black kids. Part 3, the new Jojo goes on a trip to Egypt with his racist grandpa and his Egyptian friend that just beat the shit out of him in jail to go kill his great grandfather's enemy with magical ghost powers instead of sun powers this time because now they're irrelevant. Part 4 is- Okay, I think they get it, you can fucking stop now. If you don't like the idea of the main character switching up every part, you'll get used to it. I didn't like it at first either, but there will always be a character from the previous part in the new one, which is really cool. The main characters are also really different, like part 1 Jojo, aka Jonathan Jostar, is a gentleman, respects whammon, and has good manners and shit like that. Part 2 Jojo, aka Joseph Jostar, is funny, cars, calls girls ugly, doesn't care about random people's safety, way smarter in battle, and more enjoying to watch on screen. Part 3 Jojo, aka Jotaro Kujo, is calm, badass, rude, calls his mom a bitch, tells girls to fuck off, and never gets worried in battle. Part 4 Again, they get it, you can fucking stop now. This show is really fucking weird. It goes from badass to dogs getting brutally murdered to funny to sad to fucking gay. And don't even get me started on the openings. All nine of the openings. Except Chase. Chase is fucking ass. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Jojo fans that are watching this don't get fucking triggered. Chase is pretty cool. I think that'll wrap this video up, so please do yourself a favor and watch this anime. It's funny, weird, badass, unpredictable. The battles keep you on the edge of your seats. All of the villains are intimidating as fuck. The openings are the best anime OPs I've ever seen. And yada yada does it. Just fucking watch it. You will not regret it. And it will be the most amazing experience you've ever experienced, bitch. Yeah, me,